even though I've got a 20 meter MFJ dipole set up up on the flagpole. I thought, well, it's running on the analyzer. It looked close enough that the tuner at least could tune it and make it think it's okay. So less than optimal, but hey, not much going on in 20. So I said, let's go to 17, 18135. Turn it up. I don't know how well the video will bring up the audio. It could just be noise, but it's not real loud now. There's a QSL going on. So this is what I got set up here. I've got it one click down, but I've got, I just put up the dipole on the top of the flagpole because I just grab it and it can rotate it. Let's get the station a little bit better. It worked before. Now watch, I'm trying to take a video and it's not going to help. You know, it is not going to be great. But right now, the ends of the dipole are going basically north and south. Yeah. Now that I'm trying to do a video, it's going to be a little rotten still. But it really brought up about two S units approximately the last time. A little all QRP setup. Turn it back. I can lift it up once, but the way it notches in. short, you know, QRP setup, it's at home, but all you got to do is take a regular flagpole, made a little mount for the, uh, where the normal, the ball, or if you had an eagle, it would be screwed in the top, but I just made it for the bracket for the dipole, so then each section of the telescoping tower, you know, it rotates and locks into place, but when it's one section down, you lose the height, but uh, you basically got a manual rotor. Like I said here, you just turn it. Next thing you know, you know, it comes a little bit better. So, there's the project of the day. I'm going to keep on clipping around. I don't know, I don't hear anybody calling CQ, but it'd be fun to catch somebody on it. We'll try.